This tutorial is very special because it shows a great tool that you can use on the timeline. Imagine that you have a website with some data or a direct link to statistics that you want to visualize on the timeline. In order to do this, we have a great tool for you called Reporting IPs. Today we will see how this works. I have decided to show you the result at first and then explain step by step. As you can see here on the timeline, I have two graphics and event. The blue one shows the crude oil price chart for the last five years. To get this data on the timeline, I created JSON file with all information on the paste bin. You can see the file here. Okay. And the green chart shows average American retail gas prices for the last five years. I also pulled this data off another paste bin JSON file. Okay. And we have a small event that shows minimum during this period. I want to show you how I did this and also webmasters will see that this data is shown in real time. So I will delete both of these graphics and create them again. So I created a JSON file. I need to click raw to have direct link to the website. I need to copy this. And now on the timeline, I have to click here. Then I need to call, click reporting a piece, add data provider. Then I need to put name, then paste the link from the paste bin and click create. As usual, you can customize adding description, text, position, line color, line width and height. But I just want to show you how this works. So this is this is the first chart we created about crude oil prices. So for web, for webmasters, this information will be useful in case if you need if your information is dynamic, and your website uh, information changes from time to time. So all you need all you need to do is to have a permanent link to your data, and if you change it, it will change on the time graphics too. So if I click here and click edit for example and delete from 2017 then I need to save it then also save my graphic on the timeline you see now the information has changed now it comes it ends in 2017 but if I bring it back and click edit edit again and click save and refresh the page so you see it it came back again so this is uh, so this is from this information is being reflected on the on the timeline at the time of request so let's another let's add another graphic at data provider and another J the second JSON file I created shows the American retail gas price chart for the last five years so you need to click raw to get the direct, direct link to the raw JSON date uh, JSON file copy paste it here also put name let me change the color Okay, so we have created two charts using JSON data from an from external website. Thanks for watching our tutorial.